Hello, everybody. We are here to announce the launch of Sanvi's third book that's launching today. And on this occasion, I thought of doing a little interview of our six-year-old author, Sanvi Agarwal. With me here is Driti Agarwal, who is three years old and has been supporting her sister in her book writing journey. So let me ask you a few questions, Sanvi, uh, in terms of your writing journey. First of all, congratulations. Your first couple of books did really well. They went on number one on Amazon. In fact, one of your books also won an award from Young Writers Association, which they are going to publish in their... And they're very famous yes. young writers. That's right. How do you feel about that, Sanvi? Really proud of myself. Oh. And you, because you encouraged me on my journey. Thank you, Sanvi. The credit is all yours to be having, you know, writing it all down in terms of proper stories, which takes a lot of effort. So tell me about it. How do you go about choosing the book titles? Uh, which story will you write like, next? Some, my sister just called out something that gives me some creative ideas. Some come from Word Hound. They have a topic each month. And you may as well want to join Word Hound. And some come from my school themes. Very interesting. So let's say you got a title now from any of these sources that you mentioned. How do you then go about writing the story? Like, if you think about the title, the story just comes in your mind. Mm -hmm. And then you do it with the illustrations. Okay, and how do you go about the illustrations? Like, some I draw myself, or others, my mum takes photos of me, she removes the background, and then she puts it on our book. Very interesting. So you got the title, you got the story, you got the illustration, it's then a matter of putting it all together as a book and self-publishing it on Amazon. Right. Tell us, Sanvi, what inspired you to be on this book writing journey? Uh, my mom. But she wrote a book called Life Simply Moves On. And it's saying, and it's all about life won't wait for you. It'll just move on without you. <laughs> so seeing that published into a book encourage you also to write books yes right and what else Anvi do you want to share with your readers and your fans who have been enjoying your books like if you really are into book writing here's a tip if you want to write good books you should read loads of books too they'll give you ideas to write a new book that is true. I can vouch for that because Sanvi is an avid reader and she has read pretty much all the book sets from famous authors starting from Enid Blyton, Roald Dahl or other series uh, like you know, Rainbow Magic. Uh, what are your some tell us some names of your favorite series Sanvi book series? Uh, one is My Secret Unicorn. My dad just went to a shop and he found his book set and he suggested it, and when I read it, I really liked it. Any other series you want to mention for your uh, viewers? Um, not really, but if you like unicorn stories, Nida Chapman wrote the My Secret Unicorn. I can name a, some, a few. Maybe you're forgetting those. How about the Magic Faraway Tree series? Oh, yeah. yeah. I love that one. And, and I've read it about three times. <laughs> and the Secret Seven from Enid Blyton series. How about Captain Underpants? You have also Secret read... Secret Seven? You have also read uh, that one, the Horrid Henry no. series. You didn't enjoy that particularly that much. The Dotty Detective. I love it. Dotty Detective. Like it's got five books and each of these books are about this thick. It's really fun to read. And how about the Three House series that you read as well? Did oh you yeah, that's a very nice series too. And how about the one that you're reading now on Daisy? Oh yeah, yeah. like the Daisy one is Daisy and the Trouble With and then there are many different things and at the beginning she says the trouble with this is whatever. And then they have them in all the books in the series. So, 
basically the point is read 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 because the more you read the more ideas you get that you can then write down about or you can even mix two book sets together and get a great idea absolutely what can we expect next from author sanvi agarwal what is next for you i could you're writing loads of other books aren't you so our series that we are publishing at the moment magical adventures we just finished the third book today and you're going to write more books how many are you thinking to go into that series sanvi mm. maybe 10 maybe 10 and what's after that in plan i'm going to write a you i'm going to write a series all about my little sister is sitting over here <laughs> so there's going to be watch out viewers there's going to be another series after we finish magical adventures on this little babe here jiti thank you sanvi it was lovely chatting with you and do let us know viewers if you have any questions that you would like me to post to sanvi in our next interview do check out amazon for the books from sanvi the latest one being day trip with an alien and there's two more which are the bear and the bear hunt and my spooky house perfect so until next time tata bye bye see you